Tarzan of the Apes from the novels by Edgar Rice Burroughs. With Mr. James H. Pierce as Tarzan and Miss Joanne Burroughs as Jane Porter. This is an American Gold Seal production released by the World Broadcasting System and Associated Stations. Tarzan has rescued the marooned white party from cannibals. He returns to the tribe of Kerchak, the tribe of the great apes, and defeats Takla, an ape who has disputed his kingship, and again becomes the leader of the tribe. Returning to the sea, Tarzan learns that Jane has been taken aboard ship by pirates. Alone, he leaps into the ocean and swims toward the boat. Now, are you ready? Hold your breath. Blast it, land lovers! You'll have a sight show here. Here you, lively. Get up that rope, man. Who, me? Who else? And not a word of it. Me, love, snipes? Yes. I'll pipe the light into our cabin. I'm warning you, snipes. My friends are not going to stand by and watch me kidnap. When they find where I am. Well, they ain't done much yet, they ain't. By now, King has spoke to them. And if they knew it was good for them, and you, you'll be coming back with the news as to where the stuff is in. Oh, Snipes, you're a fool. You won't listen to reason. My friends don't know where the treasure is hidden. Kidnapping me is not going to help you to find it. In fact, it's going to put you in prison when they find out where I am. Oh, but they ain't going to find out. And if I don't get the loot, well... I got you, and you ain't ought to look at. Guess I can get a couple of hundred quid for you at Singapore. Oh, you beast. You wouldn't dare. Oh, wouldn't I, though? Come on. I'm tired arguing with you. Get below. In here. You're not going to put me in there. Well, it's your old cabin. What's the matter? Ain't it good enough for you? Oh, it's it's filthy. Oh, then you guess. Lord, what is it? The lookout says that those blokes of the Admiral are running down the beach. Oh, I'll be on deck. What did I tell you tonight? They're coming to get you, and they will. Oh, shut up. Where are they? Can they see us? No, not yet. They will when they round the headland. Look, take the glasses. See there? Through the trees. Oh, strike me pink, the fools. What do they think they can do against us? What's the thing? 130. All right. You'll put up, pull up the coast. Let them think we've taken the dime away. Give them time to think about telling us where the loot is. But if they don't, no. Then we'll send them word to answer it. When they find it, then they can have the dime back. <laughs> That's the idea. Well, get our hands up. Put your motto and put her about. <laughs> Meanwhile, on shore. Clayton, Darno, and Francois stand thunderstruck as Tarzan plunges into the sea. But, mes amis, we cannot let him go alone. It is madness. Monsieur, but it is magnifique. Say, what the deuce you try to do, Darno? Let me go. We cannot allow him to go out there. They will shoot him like a dog. Take it easy, Darno. We can't stop him. And if you or I try to join him, we'll only attract the attention of these mutineers to Tarzan. I suppose you are right. But to stand here to do nothing while he goes out there? Oh, Le Bon Dieu, that is murder. No, no, and he swims also swiftly. Mm, yes, he may even reach the ship without being seen. But, mes amis, what then? What truth? What fault? How can a man teach himself to swim like that? I can't understand you. Ah, that's Monsieur Tarzan. Whatever he does, he does it perfectly. But if I... See, mon lieutenant, even we who know where he is cannot see him, no? Yes, but the farther he is from us, the closer he is to the ship. But I cannot see how it is that he hopes to get aboard without being seen and shot at. Monsieur Tarzan does not think of himself. Go easy there, King. Handle the professor gently or as I... Right, Scott. Here's Philander. And King almost carrying the professor. I couldn't help it, Clayton. 
Archimedes insisted on coming down to the beach. But, monsieur, the fee of that... Yes, John, I know. But it's less harmful this way than holding him possibly in bed. And frankly, trying to keep King covered while I wrestled with the professor was more than I could manage. So what has happened? Why have you not gone after Jane? Here, Professor, sit down here. Uh, rest yourself against the back of the boat. And that's all the use it is now, anyway. But Tarzan, where is Tarzan? Swimming to the ship. The ship? Where? She is behind the headland. And, and Tarzan is going up there alone? Yes, Monsieur le Professeur. Monsieur Platon convinced me that if I started to go to a lore, it would only attract the attention to Tarzan. But, but alone, against that crew of cutthroats. Even Tarzan can't expect to handle them alone. He did not seem to give that any thought. As soon as we found the boat was stove in, he just plunged into the water and... Well, now he went. Uh, where, where is he now, uh, Clayton? He's away over... Uh, no, no, I'm afraid you can't see him, Professor. It, it, it's, it's too dark. I can't make him out myself. And I know exactly where he is. He's swimming away beyond the headland there. Evidently, he intends to come into the ship from the open sea. He may be able to reach the ship, but to get aboard her, sort it down for sea. Oh, they'll shoot him before he reaches the ship. I'd like to be there and do it myself. If I were you, King, I'd keep still. Otherwise, now that we know where Miss Jane is, we might be tempted to save ourselves a lot of trouble by getting rid of you. But, Miss... Oh, I... save your breath. I know what you're going to say. You'd just better keep quiet. Isn't there any chance to patch up this boot? No, I'm afraid not. If we had some canvas and did a lot of bailing, we might be able to get it out there. Canvas? What about that canvas I put up for a petition for Jane? Oui, oui, monsieur, it is very possible. Here, here, let me look at the boat. Uh, pardon, I must move you for a moment, monsieur le professeur. Let's make a try at it anyway, Donna. Uh, we'll go to the hut and get some tools. Come on, King, come on. You go on ahead of me. Uh, I shall help you, monsieur le professeur. Aboard the arrow, Jane, lying on her bunk, tries to gather her thoughts. That knocking, almost as if someone were trying to signal. There can't be anyone aboard friendly to me. Oh, I'll take a chance. What is it? Miss Porter? Yes? This is Tracy. Captain Tracy. Oh, oh! I thought they killed you. No, oh, they couldn't. They need me to navigate. But while we're at anchor, they have me tied up in the cabin next to the one you're in. Won't they hear us talking? No, oh, they're all on deck, I think. Now, listen carefully. I was in the cabin that you're now in. Yes? I was laying plans to escape. Are you bound? No. That's good. Look under the wash basin. Tied with pieces of string, you'll find the three pieces of a monkey wrench. Yes. Yes, they're here. Can you fit it together? I think so. That's good. And when you have fitted it together, loosen the bolts holding your port in place. Wait till I look. Yes. Thick, rusty bolts about an inch across. That's right. Loosen the bolts, and the frame of the port will come away from the bowlers, the shells. Then the hole will be big enough for you to get through. I'll do it, Captain. I'll do it now. But keep your eyes open for them coming down below deck. You'll have to hurry. I can tell they're getting ready to make sail. I will. They're making it? Yes. Slowly. They're rusted tight. What's that? It can't be. Oh, I must get this port open. It is. I saw him. There he is again. Tarzan. Oh, he didn't hear me. I'm almost afraid to talk any louder. But I, I must chance it. Tarzan. Yay. Yeah, Yay. Yeah. Quiet, Tarzan. They'll hear you. Harmon Gunny, all up above. Tarzan, come quick. No, Tarzan. They'll kill you before you ever get up on deck. But, Jane. Not like to stay there. No, but but you. There isn't anything for you to climb up, Tarzan. Tarzan, get up some way. But Tarzan, I don't know how many men there are here. Tarzan don't care how many men. It is dark now. Oh, Tarzan, do be careful. Yeah. In a few minutes, I'll have this port big enough so that I think you can get through it. Too small for Tarzan. It won't be when I get the last bolt out. All right. Go ahead, Jen. Miss Porter. Yes, Captain Tracy. Why don't you tie the bed sheets together and lower them out the porch? He can climb up there with those. They'll hold him all right, I'm sure. Thanks, I will. How much longer, Jane? 
before you get window open. Just a minute. Shh. I hear someone. Quick. Oh, yes. Get out to the bunk. Get out then. Catch. Climb up quick. Someone's coming. Jane. Jane. Carmen Ganny no hurt you? No. No, Tarzan, not yet. I'm all right. Oh, I'm so glad to see you. Shh. Carmen Ganny coming. I'll get behind the door. You open if Carmen Ganny stops here. Yes, all right. Why you get in there? Come out. I won't come out. You'll have to come in and get me. Oh, that's the way, is it? All right. Oh, come in. Tom Tarzan hoped to win his way from the ship against the whole pirate.